bunch of ballot papers. On the ground, what is happening, our returning officers in the counties and the constituencies have recruited staff and training is going on. We also have a training that is currently going on, what we call the election security arrangement program, whereby our staff are taken through how to handle security matters and we are collaborating with the National Police Service and all the agencies that are in charge right. of that docket. Right, so so uh, we, we are ready. You are ready. That's good to hear, though. Um, you know, you've talked about uh, the gazettement of uh, the candidates who were cleared by the commission and uh, talked about uh, the delays in the printing of this uh, gazette. Um, do, is there like a tentative or day that as a commission you expect that uh, the government printers ought to uh, finalize this, that Kenyans should anticipate? Because it has elicited a bit of concern as well. Basically, from our end, uh, we expected by first or second it will have been published. It has taken too long. Is it concerning you and what are you doing about it? It is concerning us, but for us, you see, we have a deadline to meet. We have uh, the 9th of August, which by tomorrow it will be exactly 30 days. We need to be ready to ensure that Kenya will have the election. So we are saying as long as we gave out the list of candidates and it has been received and stopped, the fault is not on us as IBC. There is another face that needs to roll out. Remember, I said one face gives room to the next. Mm -hmm. So after the gazettement, we roll out the printing. But now the fault is on the government printers, not on us. And we cannot delay. Look, today is 8th, and it has not been published. Mm -hmm. So you want to tell us that we wait for this printing to begin at what time and other activities.